This next band is not only rocking and rolling, but they're also spreading a message on keeping safe while driving. With me now is the band Echo Smith. Good morning to you guys. Good morning. Good morning. Tell us, what is Celebrate My Drive? What's that all about? Yeah, well, this is a campaign um, that we're doing with State Farm, and it's basically just to promote safe driving. And, you know, it's as simple as their awesome saying, drive two and two, two eyes on the road and two hands on the wheel. So, you know, it's something that we relate to as teen drivers ourselves, and it's something that we're happy to help our fans remember, too. And, I mean, it's so simple, and if everybody, you know, tried to do this, I think there would be a lot less, you know, crashes happening. Absolutely. Why did you decide to get involved in this particular program? Has this affected either of you personally, any of you? Yeah, well, we've been fortunate enough to not be involved with, I mean, any personal car crashes. Um, but I think it's awesome, you know, you, it's never too early to be safe, you know, and for us, you know, it's a good reminder um, to, you know, be focused while you're driving and to not get distracted by all the silly things like cell phones or directions or the radio um, because we're gone all the time. It's hard to remember all those things when we come back to drive, you know, if we haven't driven for like three months, you know. So it's definitely something that we need to remind ourselves of and we thought it was the perfect thing for us to, you know, partner with. Yeah, it is a, a good cause. I understand you guys are doing a private concert for one lucky school. Tell us about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, um, people can submit their photos and videos with the hashtag drive2 and2 um, to celebratemydrive.com, and they have to submit by this Sunday to be qualified to possibly win one school. One high school will win a performance by us, and then there will be a whole bunch of other $100,000 grants that will be given out to high schools. So. There's some pretty good prizes involved. <laughs> so the deadline is drawing near. Where can people go for more information or to get signed up, throw their head in the ring? Yeah. CelebrateMyDrive.com is where everybody needs to go to find out anything that they want to know. <laughs> so you guys, I was reading a little bit about you. You're siblings, right? Is there someone missing today? Mm-hmm. Yeah? Yes, uh, we are missing our oldest brother, who actually is at home because his wife is about to have a baby. So, oh. big deal, um, <laughs> and he has a very good reason not to be here. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, what else is going on with you guys right now? We're on tour right now with 21 Pilots, and we're at the, the home stretch of it all, and this is basically you know, our last tour on the cycle where we're about to start writing new music for a new album um, next month. So we're about to have new music very soon, and we're excited about it. So there's four of you guys. Uh, how do you collaborate on music? Uh, do you guys ever battle it out? And if so, who wins? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we usually try not to, you know, pull a sibling kind of rivalry thing and fight it out. But for us, I mean, we try to make everything collaborative, and we try to make everything just the story of the band. So when we're writing a song, we want the entire band to connect with it and we want the entire band to be a part of it and have their hand in it some way. I mean, it can start with it can start with Sydney, it can start with me, it can start with Graham or Jamie. We don't really have rules on where it comes from. As long as the song becomes a story of the band and not just one person, as long as we can all back it and be a part of it and also believe in the song, then we'll we'll put it on a record. I mean that's the most important thing for us. Do you guys write your own material and uh, you know how long can it take to put an album together? Oh man, you never know. I mean, the yeah. past, the first album we did took about, I don't know, probably quite a few months. Yeah. Close to a year, including all the writing. So this time, I'm not sure. Now that we already, you know, know who we are as a band and have an identity, um, our job is just to expand on that. And, you know, when we did our first album, we didn't know exactly what we wanted to do yet. And we had to sort of have that process at the same time. So this one will hopefully not take as long, <laughs> just a few months. And I'm sure you guys are anxious to hit the road, right? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Yeah, all right. Well, Echo Smith, thanks again for talking to us and for being a part of such a positive campaign. Thanks. It's really good to see.